Right, what we're going to do is um, goes for the knowledge pace. It's a little thing to show you. We've got some uh, a lead here. What's all knackered? You get them. Um, sometimes they bash. Sometimes they're just like uh, if you get them from cheap lead makers, they're all shiny and that lot. If you want to dull them over, it's just a couple of tips how to dull them over. One thing you can do if you've got a really shiny lead and you just get some oil, sunflower oil on a rag or anything like that, you can just keep rubbing the sunflower oil on, it, on the rag. Just keep rub, rub, rubbing, and it will dull it. If you want it done, if you want it shiny, then leave it as it is. Or another way, there's one in here, what we've painted, what's been painted, and all the rest of it. It's all that good and that. So what you can do to revive your leads, you can either get some old weed, whatever it may be, from outside, of, uh, from the lake. Dry it out if it's on a sunny day, and you can use that. You can get little bags of compost, bring them along, and it makes it the woody effect, or whatever they call it, when you buy these leads, weedy or woody or whatever, and they do different effects. All I've done here, we're in this type of area, is get some dry bark off the floor, a bit of weed. I think this was all dragged out and dried because there's a big lump of it near my swim. It's just really to show you what's going on with it. So. going. If you're under 18 you need to get your parents permission. See, heat your lead up. Not too much though. You see it's starting to go. It goes really shiny. The bubble. Don't forget at this stage it doesn't matter, you just don't want to melt the lead too much, you just want it hot. We'll see how it goes in here. Being a whistle up using these things. Go it in there now, push it on. Stop being the gill. Turn that off because I'm a bit of a cheapskate. There you have it, then that's camouflaged a little bit. Um, if you, you might have a gravelly bottom, use gravel. You might have a sandy bottom, use sand. Say that's old weed there, I could have put around it. Or if you do them at home and you've got some compost in the back, or whatever, compost is really good for it. Put it in there, really get it going. Just remember to take the insert out if you're using the plastic insert styles. If it's a swivel, you just hold it by the swivel. So, reviving a bad lad into a good one or camouflaging it to your lake. There you go, guys.